Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Chris here, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can plug in a USB stick, a micro SD card, an SD card, all those kind of things into your Google Nexus 7 2013 edition. So without any further ado, guys, let's get straight into it. Okay guys, so the first thing you're going to need is an OTG cable. So on this side you've got a full size USB and on the other you've got a micro USB. You're also going to need your mass storage, so the device that you're going to be plugging in to your Google Nexus 7. Okay guys, so once you've got all of those, the first thing you want to do is pop over to your Play Store. Once you're on here you want to go ahead and click on the search thing and type in Nexus Media Importer. This is the application you're going to need here, we'll just click on it once. So yeah, it's something like £2.50, something like that. Um, and I like, really do recommend this application, guys. Once you've went ahead and purchased it, you can go ahead, click on the open button, or for me, I'll just click on the app here. And it's then going to bring you through to this. Now you don't in fact have to open it every time, we will actually come out of it just to demonstrate. So what we'll go ahead and do now is just go ahead, pop our uh, USB here into the uh, OTG cable and plug it straight into the tablet like so. So we've now plugged it in and as you can see we've got a prompt message. You want to click OK. It will then bring us through to the application itself where you can see now we've got all the different folders. So it automatically brings you through to the folders thing but if you want to specifically look for a photo you can click on photos, you can click on videos, music, documents, all sorts. We're going to click on photos. If we go through, through to our pictures bit here and click on this, as you can see this is a file I've just put on there for demonstration purposes and it's absolutely great. Really do recommend this program guys. It came out in full HD, the same file that I originally put on from my laptop. And yes, yeah, really great program guys. If you don't want to pay the £2.50 or whatever it is guys, I will also have a link in the description below um, to go ahead and check out a slightly different method of getting it. So thank you so much for watching guys and I'll catch you all in the next one.